It's Bristol week. So, today's the day before we leave out for Bristol. Um, as far as I'm aware right now, Darian is on a, about to get on an airplane, and I'll be picking him up at the airport. Jarrett is driving an eight hour drive down here, and uh, we'll be meeting up together for the first time. We, I've been working with these two for a long time on a NASCAR Weekly Podcast. This is the first time we're gonna meet each other. I'm really looking forward to that. So, I'm excited to uh, vlog the first day of just meeting them. We're gonna go hang out. We're gonna go uh, maybe have some Hattie B's chicken. Uh, I have to take them, cause, fun fact, Jarrett and Daria, they're gonna be groomsmen in my wedding coming up in October. So, I need to take them over and get them fitted for their suits for my wedding. So, yeah. That is the agenda for today. As for now though, I'm going to continue to enjoy my breakfast movie. And then get ready for their arrival. All right, so just heard from Darian not too long ago. He uh, should be on the plane right now. He's supposed to land in Nashville over at the Nashville airport at one o'clock. It's currently at this time about 9.30. So I've got time. I've got to do some things before they get here. Uh, one thing that I absolutely must do before they get here is get this area ready because this is going to be, this is my living room. It's going to be transformed into kind of like Darian and Jarrett's uh, first place to stay. I've got an air mattress here. One of them can stay on that. The other one can stay on my couch. But also, um, and obviously you're going to have already seen this now by the time this vlog comes out. I've got this camera set up here. Going to be moving around some stuff here because uh, this area right here is going to be where we do the NASCAR weekly podcast tonight. So looking forward to doing the first ever live version of NASCAR weekly podcast. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get this area ready for their arrival.
Air mattress is pumped up, put off here to the side now. Now I'm gonna go ahead and head out. I'm gonna go get, I'm gonna go to Greg Clips. My beard, a little straggly. Uh, I'll be honest, I'm not the best cut myself. I'm weird like that, so I'm just gonna go get a little beard trim is all. That's all I'm gonna do now. And uh, Darian should be here within uh, like two hours from now, so that gives me enough time to go get a beard trim, maybe even grab some lunch real fast, and then get to the airport to pick him up. So, looking forward to meeting Darian. I haven't set up the computer yet. Went ahead and uh, set up things for the stream tonight, um, but I haven't set up the computer in here yet. That's something that me and Darian can do while we're waiting on Jared. So yeah, everything's going according to plan. Let's, uh, let's go uh, get a little trim. All right. And here I am, I'm at the Great Clips, it's right there. So let's go ahead and get this shaping up. So um, just like, and that looks much, much better. I, I approve this. All lined up, nice and neat. Yep, I can dig this going to Bristol. I like it. Now, let's go get Darian. all parked up here on level p5 the only reason i'm saying that is just in case i was to forget what level i parked on here i can always look back at my video and find out i'm gonna go see if we can find darian here now here at the nashville airport so excited finally get to meet one of my most trusted uh colleagues from youtube it's uh it's kind of kind of a unique feeling i just it's like i know he's gonna be taller than i am i'm actually a pretty short guy but uh let's go let's go find darian he's gotta be around here somewhere There he is, guys. Hey, he's he's, he's real. He's in, he's in the flesh. I know, he's real. Look at him. You can touch him. Touch his face. <laughs> Don't touch my face. <laughs> Welcome to Nashville. Let's take you to get you out of this airport. Yes, for real. Had a long flight. Let's do it. Heard you played some NASCAR on your way? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I played some. I did like one race on the PSP. Cool. And then I fell asleep. I was hella tired. Cool. Come on, Darren, let's go to Casa de Danny B. Mm-hmm. Welcome. All right, Darren, there's your bed. Okay. I, you gotta figure out a way to sleep like that. I <laughs> So I, hope, I hope you can manage. I'll manage. I'll figure it out. All right. He's probably a little tired though. Yeah, probably. Well, we got the bed set up for him. All right, here we go. One half of the podcast becomes three quarters of the podcast. 
Black Sonata. That's what we're looking for. Black Sonata. Um, camera's bleaching me to death out here now. There he is. There he is. You guys do have more than just a torso. Uh, I know. Oh, so oh my you, God. Ah, oh, so <laughs> He's real. oh my god. Good to see you, man. I need to go to the bathroom really bad. Yeah. Oh, I got one of those. I haven't stopped since I since 6:30 in the morning. Well, <laughs> park next to my truck right yeah. there. Oh yeah, I can see the Tennessee one. Yep. Boy, he's chilling. Yes. Wait, you I'm... call him boy. <laughs> <laughs> He's putting some deodorant on. The iceberg. Come on, Jarrett. Come on, iceberg. Get your ice, ice butt in here. Hello. All right. These two have to get fitted because they're going to be groomsmen in my wedding. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, they've been slacking. They ain't been done. They ain't done anything yet. I just like scroll through it, that's what I do too. Yeah. Oh, I have to do the freaking signature the worst part. Mm. Oh, I know. <laughs> How's the chicken, gentlemen? I actually haven't eaten the chicken yet, I'm too busy. Hey, boy. It's chicken, I'm telling you. It's chicken, smack him. Mm. Yeah. God, man. Yeah. So good. There you go, black flags matter for Yep. Not a bus. Live here outside of Beeman Toyota, where I'm not working a day. These guys. <laughs> Beaver Toyota. Hello. So, overall thoughts on Nashville so far. How was the chicken to you guys? Oh my gosh, the chicken tasted smack you. It was so tasted just like chicken. Yes. <laughs> I hope. <laughs> Do you recommend people come to it? Yes. Yes, yes absolutely. I'll have to revisit it. All right. Good deal. All right. That's it for now. We're going back to my place to do the NASCAR Weekly Podcast, the best weekly NASCAR show on YouTube. I don't know. We, we wait that good as you can decide. It, it is. Not it is. It is. Okay. All right. Bye. 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 In person here tonight mm -hmm. on Danny B Talks channel. Air at my house, guys. What the? He get out of here! How'd you get in my house? I know, oh, man. I just broke in. I just broke in. Drove almost Dude, 600 like, miles just to out. Yeah, it's not on your thing yet, though. But it'll All right. come up later. Well, we'll get it. Yeah. Guys, successful first live mm -hmm. podcast was done tonight in awesome. our little makeshift studio that we created out of my coffee table. Right. How about that? It's cold in here, now. I'm about to shower. I'm gonna take a hot shower. Real cold, man. Well, we'll go to bed first. Yeah. All right. Uh, Derek, you can shower first, though. No, nah, I'm too worried. No, go ahead. No, no, you go ahead. Yeah, you go ahead. Get some stuff ready anyway. Just okay. go for it. All right. Yeah, All right. Okay. Darren, you ready to go to Bristol tomorrow? Yes. All right. All right. I'm ready. 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 I'm... All right. With that being said, we're out of here. Peace. Y'all gonna sleep the day away or something in here? I mean, what's going on? We gotta go to Bristol, guys. Do y'all want? Do y'all not want to see some cars going in circles for a few hours tonight? Wait. Guys, come on, get your button gear. Step one. Okay. Step one, you press the windows into roof. Step two, you place hood into opening, and hood hinge should rest inside slot. Old hood in position. Is the deck lid supposed to be under the hood? I don't know. Step three. <laughs> snap dash panel around two posts in body trapping hood hinge in place. And then so on and so on and so on. We're going to make this. Today. Weird man films two people barely awake. Yeah, I know. And he woke us up early too. That's the thing. I'm pissed off about it. You woke us up early, like 30 minutes. Like, it's time for Bristol. My boy, we this still got 30 minutes. 30 more minutes. <laughs> yeah, I got 30 more minutes of sleep. I heard your alarm go off three times, and then like the third time it was some wrestler. Who was it? Some wrestler's thing. Was it? No? no. I'm just crazy? Yeah, you're crazy. Yeah, I'm crazy? 
I swear to God, I thought you I are think. wacko. No, I'm not wacko, dude. I swear to God, I heard some wrestler theme or something like that. No, it was like the third time. Yeah, it was mm -hmm. the the first two times it was like some regular alarm, and the third time it was like <laughs> something like that. I'm. I, so I, I swear I, to God, I think that's he's lost what it. happened. I think he's lost. That's it. what happened. No, I think you've lost he it. it to begin with. <laughs> I think you've lost it, Danny V. We've all lost it at this point. Let's be real. Right. Stop making me look like a fool on the OA. Oh, I already do that myself. I already make myself. He do that. said it, guys, not me. <laughs> so we do have a few minutes before we have before we're ready to leave. The guys are downstairs putting their stuff away, and uh, to pass some time, we got a little bit of out of the groove. Eric, you step on the TV. Hi, Eric. Wish you were here. But you're not. We'll see him Saturday, I guess. According to this report, it seems Hi, Eric. That will stay yeah, we are really looking forward to this trip. We have been looking forward to it for quite some time. Um, yeah, this is going to be a blast. Truck series today and K and N series. Um, Haley Diggins racing the K and N series, so hope she does well. Yeah, that's all I'm gonna do while we're still at my apartment. Uh, I'm gonna go pick up Claudia soon, and then we're on to Bristol. All right, you guys ready to go? I'm out of here. Hell yeah! Let's go. Uh, can you turn off the light switches? Oh, let me make sure I got my cords. Let's roll up. Mama, it's dark in here. Oh, that's a cooler. Let's roll up. All about roll up. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Yep. We're in for a hot day. All right, let's go pick up Claudia, guys. Yep. All right, we found Claudia. Yep. He nah. didn't record me. Picking me up, so. Sorry. I didn't randomly just show up. <laughs> We're hungry though. We're gonna get some breakfast. Alright. What'd you get, Darren? I just got a McGrew. Cool. cool. What did you sleep with? Did you bring your own blanket? Yeah. You yeah, could have given up. that blue one that's in your closet. The one that Jamie and Josh gave me. Oh, uh, I forgot about that's that. That's a massive blanket. Sorry. It's a massive fail then. I was so cold. <laughs> I was like, His stepsister and um, husband gave me a blanket, but I have a bajillion blankets at my house, so I just wanted to keep it. It's like a queen king size blanket. Uh, uh, and it was in his uh, closet. <laughs> Sorry, I, 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 I think you woke us up early too. Like I'm a horrible person. Agreed. <laughs> well, you know what? Since you guys, you know, I'm sorry. I'll just go to race by myself and leave you guys here. <laughs> no, I pay for my tickets. So. <laughs> <laughs> I already pay for everything. Pay too much for that. I'm not above the check. We're heading out, guys. You ready? Oh, yeah, Autobots, roll out. Let's do it. This tram is going into motion. Mm -hmm. Next stop, JP's NASCAR. Ooh. Oh, yeah. How far is it? About an hour. Hour 20. Oh, okay, cool. I guess we gotta pick this up. We're getting this for Daniel's groom's cake. We're gonna have a Hendrick Motorsports cake. Let's see what else. Oh, there's Alex Bowman. Probably need to get this one too. Looks like it's gonna be a bigger crowd last year. 
with the traffic I've had driving through. Yeah, yeah he's got well, I made a YouTube video different. channel, and it was titled, Things to do in Tennessee, and I'm Hats to my suppliers. They only sold them to Fanatics. Yeah, because that's the one that I always buy, those fitted new well, air. they're over here for like seven ninety-five and five bucks. Wait, they're how much? Five dollars and seven ninety-five. The junior ones are seven ninety-five. There's four different styles of juniors. So many shirts. He's got most of the drivers in here. So definitely can find something you might like. Oh, Daniel's getting a car. For Lenny. Daniel, what do you think of the store? JP's NASCAR is always amazing. You need to come here if you haven't before. Yeah, watch his video. Uh, things you should do on the way to Bristol. See? We're even doing it ourselves. But it's so much to choose from. Cars. There's clothes over there. Old kind of memorabilia stuff. Hats. Flags. Even got some collegiate things. And a bunch of 124s. And some helmets too. So what's your all's thoughts on this store? I love it. It's pretty awesome. Good to have them. Yeah. Seriously, like I'm looking at everything up. here. So much. I think what one of the, the biggest things that stands out to me is the Jimmy Johnson front well, right there. Yeah, well, I'm, well, walking in, I'm like, I'm sitting here, I'm like, all right, Eric would love this, Roots would love this. Well, that's me here, and that's Dale Earnhardt. He was in Nashville 29 days before he got killed. Oh, and wow. I got him to sign that leather coat. That's Dale's signature there. And then those guys, they all signed it. No, the coat ain't for sale. That's all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, the car, I mean, I just, I never drive the car. I, I drive it around the block like once every five to six weeks just to keep That's the car right there. Fight. So what's, All right. so Danny's leading the count right now. Of, uh, yeah. recognized. Just got recognized inside of JP's NASCAR before we left. Uh, these two guys, yeah, they kind of didn't really know who they were. It's okay though. They're going to get plenty of fans seeing well, this Well, they weekend. recognized him because of his video saying yeah, to come here. So. He, he literally told me my video on things to do here in Tennessee. He I came here because of that. I channel too. <laughs> <laughs> kind of. Kind of. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. These, okay, so they have, okay, they have these. Danny B, sponsored by Monster. What happens is the people in these. Yeah, don't look that up. <laughs> Wait, yeah, I haven't found it yet. Don't look it up. There's nothing of value there. Don't look okay. I'm gonna find it. There's nothing of value there. It's, if you touch it there and your phone's going out the window. Here, here it is, guys. Legendary pals. So it always starts, then there's running. Step your game up. Get your money up. I told you that yesterday. Get your money up. Bro. You kept on your word. Uh -huh. All right, here we go. All right, got our food here, guys. Yeah. We're going to circle around so we can kind of get organized. As always, I love pals. I really want to know how these got vodka. Mm, they're yeah, good. They're good. They're the old cheese. I That's like real good. Mm. I like that we're taking up a spot in our competitor's parking lot to eat it. <laughs> no. Yeah, if you can see behind Jared is Arby's. Oh, please, Arby's is no competition. We're helping out in every way we can. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because Pals is a drive through only, as you can see. But, I mean, where else are you going to find a building with all that food all literally all over it? Yep, mm -hmm. right there. Who wants my tomato? No, 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 no. Just pull it like it's already up. Now just pull it. Let's try and put it up more. Oh. 
<laughs> just if you guys get annoyed with us, just think that we're helping you in the long term prepare for having annoying kids. Yeah. <laughs> Appreciate it. We're going to stop in and get some race snacks and breakfast soon, right? Yep. And these cough drops. <laughs> oh shoot, I forgot to look for a cooler at JP's. Look, you can meet Kevin Harvick here. You know you're in NASCAR country when you come to a grocery store and they have all this NASCAR stuff here. They probably would give me the bread. Look at that. I like the I don't know that he is. When he gets to where you got should be a black flag though. I think we should just have Take out the white part. Yep, right there. Buddy, do you want the green one? That's an ugly one. Meanwhile, while we couldn't find Rusty and Cody, we did find their true location. <laughs> What's up, guys? I'm not just at any trick. I'm not just at any trick. It's fucking Bristol, baby. Let's go. All right, so we don't know where uh, Cody and Rusty went to, but we do have Michael. Michael Klein is here. Uh, on. I guess the Lombards are still on their way, plus maybe yeah. a few others. So uh, we're gonna just go ahead to go ahead and head to the speedway now. Let's do it.
Oh, come on. What's up, man? What's, what's up? <laughs> okay, subscribe, 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 subscribe. Uh, yeah, subscribe. Subscribe, NASBLOGS. On Saturday. <laughs>
trying to push Natalie Decker off the track after being involved in an incident, and then that is her onto it. I think she wanted to turn on. Only one caution so far, other than the safety caution. Race man was looking at the bar on the Thoughts on the trucks, Claudia? It's fun. I like it. Good. How'd you like the race, Dad? How'd you like going in the pits? I love going down in the pits. This is probably one of the best race experiences I've been to. I agree. And you know what? 
I know you ain't gonna be here tomorrow. Me and her can do it all over again tomorrow. But now we gotta go find our friends. And we're gonna go home, chill out, and play some NASCAR video games, and enjoy the rest of the night. All righty. As we made our way out of the grandstands and out of the arena, we reflected on the fun memories that we had made on this first day, and we made plans to go home and reflect and just recuperate with everybody from the group as we prepared for two more days of exciting racing action at Bristol Motor Speedway. Go shopping. Are you ready? Buy more stuff I don't need. Well, who says we're really buying a whole lot? Huh? Who says we're gonna buy a whole lot? I don't know. Well, knowing me, I'll find some. <laughs> That'll be some good stuff in here. Yep, this looks like a guy on average race. Oh, hush. <laughs> Look, they, they turned one of the bigger <laughs> scale ones into it, too. Yeah, this is how he ended up looking in this one, I think. That was, um... That was Talladega. Yeah, we went to that one. Yeah. I don't remember him wrecking in this one, though. Yeah, well, and they said that sometimes, uh... They just do it to be creative. Yeah. All right, so this... I need to buy that for Eric Kaplinger. I think he'd really appreciate this one. Signed Michael Waltrip car. That is cool. That's cool. Yeah, this looks really awesome. So much detail in this car. Wow. There is so much detail going on in this. Oh my goodness. I mean, that looks like I feel a like you could, car. I feel like you could legitimately just get in that and start driving it. Because Chase designed this hat and they give it up to so many people that went to oh, that baseball okay. game. So then it has like the baseball thing. So if you were. That's awesome. Alright, Claudia. We haven't really found anything we want to buy yet, but we hear that the pump crack is going on. We're still looking for it. Maybe that's a good thing we have to find this day. Yeah, I hope so. The shopping still continues here at Bristol Motor Speedway. a bit of NASCAR history sitting right in here. Looks like a GMS hood right here. That's pretty cool. Um, let's see, a discount tire. That might be one of... I don't think that would be Brad. I think that might be like David Reagan's car. Ooh, I see a Smithfield up there. That's going to be uh, Eric Amarola from recent. Um, double zero. That looks like Cole Custer. Another GMS hood. We've got quite a few good looking stuff in here. Ooh, I see that. Dr. Pepper Toyota? And that's an Alex Bowman by chance. Quite a lot of good stuff here, and I might be tempted to buy something. 
Hey guys, Danny B. I got spotted uh, by what's your old name again? Trevor. David. Trevor and David. They're fans of the channel. How long have you guys been watching? Um, about a year and a half now. Okay. Uh, just recently watched your um, last weekly podcast show. And great advice on the, um, some of the races that we already had. But you know what? You do a good job anyway with the weekly podcast and all the other stuff we've been doing. So, you know, just keep it up, man. They want that crowd. Do what you gotta do, keep original, don't do away like, stealing off someone's and you're gonna be on um, a great YouTuber. Keep up the good work. I appreciate you guys watching. And uh, keep watching on the videos. All right. I'm working on more stuff. Alright, there you go. Alright, more madness continues here on Friday here at Bristol. Had to walk away from Claudia for a minute. She uh she wants more time to shop. Uh, I gotta head into the pits again. Um, meeting up with uh, the rest of the gang here. We gotta we got a little important meeting, some important people, so uh, don't really want to get into that too much. But yeah, we're gonna head on in and uh, go back down to the pits for a while. Here we go. Long, long, long walk down the tunnel here. In this one. So, hanging out here at the RCR area right now. It's still a spin. Uh, get the, get the, get right, right, right outside of uh, Daniel Hamrick and Austin Dillon's pit. Uh, Next big star racing right here. Next big star racing right here. Oh, that's me. <laughs> oh, I can't there see anything. Go. There we go. How old are you? I'm 10. Are, what are, are, you, are you racing right now? Yeah. What are you racing? Quarter midgets. Nice. Where are you planning to go after that? Wherever you can get in, right? Yeah. Good, good answer. One, two, three. Hi. Oh, she was good. Okay, thanks. Hey. Having to hold all of our 
food. So she can try meat choice. Madness. How? I feel bad for him sometimes. Do you know? Oh, it's a picture of the track, and that has all the That is cool. I like it. Gentlemen, please take your seats. The driver crew chief meeting will begin in 10 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> I got it right. From Comcast, always good to see her with us, manager of motorsports, Martin and Sarah Hill. Sarah, good to see you. Please index your wheel and check your restraint system. Signaling the NASCAR inspector you are ready to participate in the race. Lights are illuminated. Slow down to a cautious pace. Please be aware and respectful of the emergency services vehicles and personnel that are responding to the incident. Are any questions on tonight's race? Gang, let's put on a great race here. It's Frisco, baby. Let's show them how it's done. Billy, you need some credit? trailer for night if they get ready to do 500 laps here tomorrow night. You got a pen? She got one. Yeah, we come, we come prepared. You're welcome. Hey, can she get a picture for giving you a pen? Yes, for sure. Thank you, Austin. Thank you. Have a good day. You too. racing here in the Xfinity Series. Everyone's getting ready. The, uh, the adrenaline is pumping. The hype is getting real. Pit crews are getting ready. Everyone's ready to go 300 laps here. I love that sign for the guys in the way now. It's like his little sign is there. Little oh, Pillsbury Doughboy. I like it. Whose team is that? Oh, Cole Custer. Wait, Cole Custer? Yeah, I think Well, Well, he has a banana too. Banana? Interesting. Samantha.
chicken in the lap? I don't know! Oh, it was probably the lap I hit yeah, that thing, man. Right on the, the racing rage surface. Well, not the huh? racing surface, but. Kamikaze had a what? Sounds like you put a rage video out. Where? Wait, what? I don't know. I'm looking at what? Oh, because all guy are lost, yep. Yeah. Oh. Where's he? Oh. Oh. North Dakota. <laughs> Here it is. Season in January. Wait, come on. That's Cody H. Gaming, the runner, the runner up in a NASCAR 05 tournament. That table has like over combined 50,000 subscribers. Yes. There you go. <laughs> this table, uh, yeah. 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 we're close. Almost 14, 8. Oh seven. my god, it's Jake Bernstein. Thank you. Go. All right, Darren, was it worth flying out here for some Waffle House? Darren, it's always good when I come out here, dude. We don't got him in Vegas, so uh, it's always a blast when I come out here. Jarrett, you look full of energy. Uh, yeah. He's got sore throat, throat and everything. Sore throat. Good morning, person, right here, guys. It's a morning, person. All right, y'all, what's up? We heading in now. Round three here at Bristol Motor Speedway. We're about to go meet up with our gang over at NASCAR Pole Position Magazine. We got a lot of fans ready to meet. You excited, Darian? Oh, I'm very, very excited. Very excited. We got our guy Jake Baskinger hanging out with us now. What's going on? He's a Kyle Busch fan. Obviously, it's good territory for him. It's great territory. Oh! Hey, you need to get parked and go meet up with us. Uh, hey guys. Talk about perfect timing. Yeah, that perfect timing. <laughs> oh my god. That's why you always be recording. You always keep the camera out. Let's go properly meet him, guys. Oh, it's real so good to meet you. What's up, Eric? Oh, I love this. Sure. This is amazing. Bro. That is phenomenal. This. this is like, this is the best I money you've got. Well. Yeah, no, this is, easy. this is very easy. It's very easy. You can do that. I've had each other almost a year and a, over a year and a half, and now we're finally all in. Yep. This is beautiful. <laughs> I love the shirts. We all went with the throw. Well, you didn't quite go with the throwback. Well, I'm like, this is Dupont, Dude, and this became oh, Exalta. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> right, get, get beside him. Get beside him. Look at this. Wow. <laughs> I gotta take it. Wait. <laughs> Wait. Dueling vlogs? Or are we gonna make a triple vlog so here? Oh, trip. You know right. that apparently it's a vlog oh, inside oh, of a man. No, no, I perfected, I perfected your camera. Hey, everyone's I'd like to introduce you guys to everybody here. What's going on, baby? Did you guys know we're vlogging? I don't know. We got fans ready to meet Eric here. And this is where we all lose the copyright. Yep. Eric won. All right. See you, Eric. Bye. Enjoy. Jared, what are you doing, man? <laughs> Is your official Does it pass inspection? Yeah, did it pass? Right. Spoiler spoil check. Yeah, yeah, make sure it's not we got a little bit right here. We got yeah, a, we a main a racing wheel. Yeah, they, they, they stole a wheel from the team here. Stole a wheel. Oh, wow. They stole a wheel. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> that is funny. It's funny, they, they take the basic car and then they just, they, they take it down a few notches for these like uh, racing experience cars. And obviously at the second seat. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Don't blame the guy for under watch racing vibes. <laughs> yeah. 
Hey, it's a good show. Don't you judge it. I haven't seen it, so I'm not Whitney judging Whitney Dillon is hilarious. You, you heard her yeah, from Sloppy Joe. I know, that was funny when she said Austin Dillon's about to win a third championship. I started dying. I thought that was He does have two championships. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, it's not wrong. All right, so we've kind of been checking out these uh, merchandise hauls right here. Now we're going to... Hey, 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 guys, how's it going? We're going to go uh, over here back now to where the tent vendors are and maybe check out the NASCAR pole position magazine. Oh, we got a big uh, group gathering over here. <laughs> Meeting up with some awesome fans of our content, podcasts, etc. Racer. We're just a yeah, young. Yeah. We're just YouTubers. Yeah. Right. Oh, yeah, I'll sign it. Everyone's gonna sign it. Blue, anybody blue? So he dressed in RCR. I'm putting mine in pink, so yeah, mine stands out. Blue. Blue. Sharpie. Some, I need a Sharpie. There. Sign the kid's hat. Uh, uh, he's gonna go meet her later. Oh, okay. Yeah. Anyone else yeah. gonna sign it? about the pits is they don't have seats down there so I'm gonna chill out enjoy the view okay I'm just gonna take over for Danny Beefen right now um yeah that was nice to sit in the shade grab some free monster so I'm gonna look at some of the haulers while Danny B and the other YouTube guys finish doing their meet and greet um yeah I got asked by a kid if I was a YouTuber no not not really but this is fun taking his camera every once in a while and Getting film. That's a cool shot. Anyways, but yeah, I'm gonna check out some haulers and just like looking at different merchandise. This is one of the cool things about uh, NASCAR races that you just get to walk around, enjoy the haulers. Of course, that's the one I like the best, but a little biased. All right, let's go check that out. So we don't like gifts. All right, here we go. Paul Bush has his own hauler, of course. Lots of people out here. This is a local, um, I believe it's in Johnson City, kind of brewery. Danny got the iced tea one that I was talking about, I didn't like. How was it? It's so refreshing. I feel like a hot, sweaty mess right now. All right, turn it so we can see. Monster. 
Please sponsor me. They just got done meeting fans at the Pole Position magazine. Just taking a break. Doing Monster. All right, so I've kind of got separated a little bit from our group here. Still hanging out with uh, Sloppy Joe. What's uh, up, guys? I'll have to say this. This point, this close to the beginning of this race, I think this is the most people that I have seen here at Bristol in quite a few years. So I'm really looking forward to kind of see what this crowd looks like when we're all inside. I feel like it's going to be a good sized crowd. So uh, hoping for the best, hoping for a great race tonight. We're going to go probably uh, hang out in the pits again for a little while. How did you go? Know? Two minutes down the road. Oh. They, I think Rusty's going into the pits just me. for whatever. Yeah. I'm going to go in here because if I spend one more minute in that infield, I might die of dehydration. Yeah, I think we're going to go into infield. Okay. Uh, I'm going in <laughs> to hide under the, in the shade of the Honestly, they told me I can wear whatever I want as long as it's not conflicting sponsors. Yeah. So I'm going to change into shorts and my flying three shirt. Oh, it is. That's what I'm going to do. You guys go up the stands? No, we're going down here. All right, all right, all right. Hit, hit me up when you guys are done. Is he going to the stands? Yo, Rusty, how hyped are you? You're about to walk on the track at Bristol. What's the question? <laughs> You're about to walk down the banking at Bristol. Not just any banking. <laughs> 30 degrees of banking. 30 degrees high bank. At Bristol. At Bristol, baby. Look at you, like, you are a sweaty you. mess right now. Jump to the pool. <laughs> <laughs> well, also, the way, I still sweat like a Batman. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's I know. It's an hour to race time. I'm telling you, this looks like the best crowd I've seen here in quite some time. Look, we even got a lot of people up there on the top even. That doesn't really fill up that often. I don't know. I don't know. I've never really seen anybody up there. I know. This has looked like a good crowd so far. Cars on that side of the track. You got Richard Childress walking in the flesh here, guys. <laughs> There's almost like a like a amber color. It looks yeah, nice. So that looks good. All right, we're all good. We all got, of the things we brought on grip. I mean, I I bought this here, but still everything that we wanted to get on grip got on grip. So this is taken away from your all's family. Though. No, no, no. He he enjoys it. You know. Martin Truex Jr. 
Good luck, Brad. Got two of the racing lives here. Meeting up some of our fans from earlier. I'm very excited. Look, I'm right here in my, in my, in my comfort zone. We got Alex Bowman's team. They are, they are kind of like uh, more or less preparing on how they're going to conquer 500 laps here tonight.
As we left the house after a fun weekend of racing, we all found ourselves with a truly memorable experience that we will never, ever forget. And would we do it all over again? Of course we would. This has been a production of Danny B. Talks. Thank you so much to Bristol Motor Speedway for the extreme hospitality. Thank you so much for NASCAR for all of your hospitality as well. Thank you so much to all of my friends for joining me. And I'll see you again at my next race. Bye, guys. Come to Bristol.